Hi, Mark here from Lydian Stream. This is the first in a series of videos dealing with production in the studio and what they don't teach you in music school. So we'll be leading off. The first one will be all about you and the client. Okay, so we're going to start with your client's musical vision. You have to remember all the time that your clients come with a picture in their mind with a sense of what the music's going to sound like. He or she wants something specific. They've come to you because you're good and you have something unique to offer them, but you have to keep an open mind all the time about what they want. That way they will come back for more and other clients in the same way. Being open. This is about taking on ideas from the client that actually may not be what suits you 100%. But this is good because it empowers the client and it makes you be open, take on new ideas and discover other creative ways of doing things, creating a wonderful bond between you and the client. Trapped in habits. What does that mean? Many times you'll default to stuff which is easy and familiar to you without thinking about it. Same old drum sounds, typical harmonies that you use, same kind of synth sounds that you're using, stuff like this. You need to always be thinking outside the box, looking for new and original musical ideas. Pushing our own musical boundaries. If you don't do this, you're going to be stuck doing the same thing, you're going to become musically boring and you're going to bore yourself in the end and nobody's going to want to work with you. The way to deal with this is go out, listen to new music, discover new sounds, be brave, don't be scared of unfamiliar stuff, embrace music. What music does your client love? You need to go out and be listening to the stuff that they really like. Ask them for a list of music they're fond of, that they're passionate about, that turns them on. It may not even be close to what they want to do, but you'll get a sense of what turns them on. It will also, going back to the point before, make you go out and discover new stuff. Patience. It's really important to be patient with your clients. Often it can take much longer than you think to develop a mutually respectful, powerful relationship between you and the client. This comes from having patience, working slowly, and understanding that it's gonna be a slower process than you think. The end result is really a powerful combination of you and your client and realizing your client's dreams. Push the client, gently, but push them to be creative and push them to be involved. This will only enhance your power and empower them to understand that you're secure about who you are as a producer, you're secure about your own creative powers and you're really happy to take on their ideas and find a way for it all to come together in a common musical voice. Be honest, none of us know everything. If anybody says they know everything, leave the room. Remember what your job is. In the end, your job is to support the client, realize their dreams and not yours. It's really easy to get sidetracked and we try to put the stuff in that we like to put in, but that's not gonna help you or the client. Again, I wanna say it, remember, this is about your client and it's not about you. Okay, take on board those points. I really suggest they'll really help you. If you like what I'm talking about here, please subscribe, share, you know, other people, let's get them on board. Thanks for joining me and only good stuff.